Hello everyone, exciting news. Currently we are in Welland, Ontario and we have something exciting to share with us, Mesh Mystery here and of course me, Ellis, telling you the greatest opportunity today. Yeah. So tell us a little bit. Uh, absolutely. So we're super excited and pumped to bring you this opportunity from Empire Homes. Empire, as you know, for the last 30 years is known for building amazing communities. And this is no different. This is spectacular. We're actually on the Welland Canal minutes from everything that this side of uh, Ontario has to offer. Yes. Niagara Falls, the wineries, you name it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. There's, there's great shopping. Uh, U.S. is near as well. Yeah. Uh, for people that don't know, like like even even in uh, crossing the border is like probably what 20 minutes, 25 minutes from here. Yeah, even less. Even, even less. less. I mean, you have Crystal Beach, you have Lake Erie right at your footsteps, and I think a lot of people have always been looking for these type of opportunities in the GTA, and you just can't find them. And if Absolutely. you do find them, you're paying right. twice to three times what you actually can get yes. uh, right here at this particular location. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so we we arrived we arrived uh, here a few hours ago, and we already spoke to uh, to to people here that that moved from Ancast Ancaster. Uh, they moved from uh, Toronto. Toronto. Actually, the there city. was Burlington. Burlington, you got. Uh, so all over the place. So, so what's the reason? T tell us a little bit about the prices. Come on, come on, show us. Freehold townhomes, right here. Yeah. So freehold townhomes are going to start in the mid 600s. I mean, that's a price that was circa 15 years ago in the GTA. So if you're a family starting out or you're looking for an investment unit, I mean, nothing beats the price per square foot for these entry points. What's even more important is the semi-detaches are not even that much more. So, right. I mean, if you have the ability to climb out of that 650-ish range into the mid 700 ranges, you're gonna get more square foot, more bang for your dollar, and you're in this phenomenal location. Yeah. We have VIP exclusive access for this yes. at the moment, yes. right? Yes. Before the public, before anybody else. That's right. And I mean, you know, you hear so many different things in the marketplace right now. I'm sure if you just scroll online, you go on Google, you've got 50 million people saying that we've got access to buildings and that they take you down a rabbit hole of sign up here, sign up here, sign yeah, up here. Yeah. And they're sending you all kinds of listings for projects that you didn't even sign up for. Right. We actually are working directly with Empire. So they are the developer. Mm -hmm. And so when we say we have access, um, we have access. So before the, the, the grand launch on the 29th of April, if you take a look at what we're presenting to you and you like it, either Ellis or myself, Mesh, we're happy to bring you back here and you can actually book a physical lot. They're taking bookings now. So that's something we can provide for you guys. No, absolutely. And we will have our phone numbers uh, right here on the display yeah, absolutely. showing if you want to call Mesh or myself, not a yeah. problem. But just let me let me circle, circle back. back. Yes. Circle back. Yes. Like we will we have a the, uh, touch display TV yeah. uh, that we will show in a minute. Yeah. But a freehold townhouse uh, with 1,453 square feet at $664,000, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah, absolutely. So you, you show the full floor plans and all that stuff. And then semis, a 719, a single detached, 699. No, 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 hold on, hold on. Not 699, let's get them too excited. Come on. Nine, where, where do you see 699? 699, right here. Single detached, 27. 699. Okay, I stand corrected. Did you see that? I stand see? completely corrected. So, come on, man. That's no, but was... it was good. No, no, no. Yeah, but but it's good. But it's, great. Great. It's, a, it's, it's a smaller single, yeah. but still 699. Yeah. So 699, but what's most important is like, let, let's say you have a, you, you have a family or you're, you're, you're starting, starting a family mm. or you're, you're moving along. To get into a detached property that's over 2,000 square foot mm -hmm. on a 33 or a 36 foot lot, they have them here and the premium lots actually back on the canal. So a lot of us all want to have waterfront properties and whatnot, Absolutely, right? Yeah. Here you can actually get onto the Welland Canal for not that much more money. And you know, you can see paddlers and boats and all kinds of stuff in your backyard. How, now, how cool would that be? No, that, that, that's amazing. And those, uh, I find that those properties throughout the, the entire province hold their value. Absolutely. When you're on the water, you're on the water. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Like Absolutely. That's, that's, that's what it comes down to. So having said that, you mentioned 2,000 square feet at 799. Yeah. On a 33 foot lot. Yeah. Right? Uh, and uh, um, Empire, uh, how many did they pre-built pre for, for model homes? Oh, Two, there's three. three. So three. there's three that will probably be able to take you in through after right. get some perspective on those, right? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. 
So this is the perfect opportunity for you to show a couple of models on this beautiful touch display. Absolutely. So we had mentioned they have multiple different units, but the three we'll touch on are the ones that most of you are going to look for. So right. we're going to talk about townhouses. They're all freehold, so there won't be any unnecessarily costs associated with fees and whatnot. So if we take a look here, we have different elevations, but you see starting at about 664, you can get into something like this. Okay, beautiful looking, architecturally nice. Square footage is about 1450 square feet. So it's a good size. Right. Okay. And if we go- Three bedroom, two bath. Right. Three bedroom, two bath, absolutely. Uh, what I wanted to mention as well is, remember we had said they have semis. So for not that much more money, if you wanted to get into semi even, you can get a semi. At so the nice thing about that is you don't have a neighbor on one side of you, right? So having a semi is great, same idea. For a little bit more money, you get a little bit more square footage, but you start getting into four bedroom range. So for some families, that's more important. You don't want to have the extra bedroom, nursery, office. So how much was, was the Tano? 689? 664. 664. Sorry. So 664. So we're talking for another like 60, $60,000. Exactly. You can get into more square footage. Yes. And a semi. You got it. You got it. Okay. And now probably the most, so you, we were both correct. So you were correct in saying, hey, starting point for detach is over here. Right. Um, so we've got one here at about 749 for a smaller unit, but for argument's sake, let's look at one of the bigger units. Cause a lot of people want to say, well, how big, can, like, what, what can we get? What's one of the bigger ones we can find, right? So if we look down here, this model I think is their biggest model. Mm -hmm. So compared to Toronto pricing, right? Because that's what we're comfortable in the custom sure. looking at. If you were to tell me in this day and age that, you know, an hour and 20 minutes from Toronto proper, Right? Maybe a little bit less from the Burlington side of things mm -hmm. or Hamilton side. You could find a detached house that is almost, you know, 2,700 square feet with four bedrooms, three baths for under a million dollars. I'd say, show me where that is. Yeah. I didn't, I wouldn't believe you, but we're showing it to you right now. Here it is. This is the one, you yeah, know, it, but, but listen, like, I, I, I think it's not only that, I think it's also the lifestyle, right? Yeah. Like a lot of people, a lot of my clients, yeah. they want to get out. Yes. Like traffic, uh, they, 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 want, they want to have their kids in better schools. Yes. Uh, most of my clients are working online or, or they don't have to be in an office every day. They can commute a couple of times a month and they're okay with that, but yeah. they want peace. Yeah. Right? Once they're at home, they yeah. want peace. So you touched on something very important. So right. when it comes to schools, just like a lot of these master plan communities in the past, the city gets together with the developer and then the developer actually has a big say in reshaping what the, the city and the town looks like. Yeah. So Empire's already built a massive athletic center yeah. just up the street, which we will highlight a little bit. So what's amazing is if you're into outdoor sports, especially dragon boating, you know, any water canoe, sculling, any of that type of stuff, there's a facility for you to train and learn, which is amazing, okay? There's also talks with all of these things where potentially two new schools would be constructed. Now, how long that takes, we sure. don't know. Absolutely. But the existing schools in the area are actually quite well as well. So yeah, but right the, away. But listen, but, 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 but we have seen it. Like I've been, I've been in this business for a long time and, and yeah. you have too, yeah. to see like Milton has developed this way. Absolutely. Right? Through builders and they build Absolutely. schools. And anatomy and whatnot. Anatomy sure. and whatnot, sure. right? Like yeah. so, so we have seen other cities that grew like Welland yes. is growing, right? Absolutely. So, Absolutely. so this is this is definitely a good opportunity, and 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 touching on on the look of of these properties, like you know, like there's it's not beautiful. much you can say. It's beautiful, big windows. Yeah. Uh, Empire is a good builder, so they have proven over the years to build good good products, right? So. Absolutely, absolutely. Now, one thing we want to look at here is a site plan as well. It gives us a bit of an idea of where things are, so you can still see. There's quite a lot of availability right now. So I'm told when phase one first was released, there was about 200 lots, they had 400 worksheets. Okay, which means the demand was double that of the supply. Two, two one, yeah. This go around as well, I, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's gonna be very similar. Because you know where we are in the market, like things have leveled a little bit for people. Interest rates are holding a little bit. So we don't know whether they're gonna go up or come down right away, but right now I think people have priced in you know, what the rates are. And so to be able to buy something now with the closing of next year, it gives them a little bit more comfort in saying, okay, if rates are gonna come down potentially next year, lines up good for when I'm actually closing on this property. So 
So you have seen a little bit of the uh, showroom here, a yeah. couple of models. We talked about the lots, we talked about the community. Yeah. So how about closing? When are they closing? So this is a great thing. Unlike a lot of other developments where you know, you're know you three, four years out, if you're looking to move, this is great because occupant, that's not even occupant, the actual taking title mm -hmm. is gonna start June of 2024 all the way till the end of that year. So June till December, depending on what unit, depending on what right. lot and where you are. So really you're looking at one year to close, which is very reasonable. Yeah, and, and, and even like like even on, 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 on this marketing, marketing community sheets from Empire Canals, yeah. like like the, the the proposed future residential, it it's it's crazy. Like it's a whole list of yeah. upcoming up, upcoming uh, uh, future homes and, yes. and commercial space and all of that stuff. So, um, in terms of down payment, yeah, what does that look like? For example, yeah. for, for, for townhomes, Let, let's let's start with freehold, yeah. townhomes, entry okay. level. What does that look like? Yeah, so we'll have you know that, you know what, it's definitely comfortable and it's not gonna break the bank and it's gonna be within most people's reach. So, you know, with your offer, cause these are gonna be firm offers, unlike a traditional 10 day cooling, if you're coming here before the pre-VIP launch, they gotta be firm, okay? <laughs> so it just, it's, it's, it's fair to everybody, right? Because there's so many people who want the units. If, if we're not sure, then they're gonna go to the next person. So 10,000 with your offer, then another 10,000 in 30 days. Okay, so your first month, you're up to 20,000. Then in 90 days, so three months out, another 10,000. So now we're up to 30,000. So 30,000. And now it's saying in 150 days, so just shy of six months, that's about five months, looking at 10,000. And then the balance to 10% within 365 days. Okay, so we put that in perspective, within a year, 10%. Staggered over the course of a year, if that makes sense. So if, if, if someone purchases the, the Spruce at 664. Yeah, so basically it would be, you know, 10,000 with the, with the offer, then at the end of the then, month, another 10,000, then three months out, 10, so by three 90. months, you've done 50% of your deposits. Got it. And then in the fifth month you've done, an, you know, you're almost there. And then by the time you get to the full year, you'll be at your 10%, which would be that $64,000. Yeah. So when you mentioned the firm deal, I just I, I just want the viewers to understand that that the reason why Empire or the builder is asking to be a firm deal with, with no condition or cool off period, yes. which which they like yes. to call it, yes. is because you are getting the opportunity to choose before anybody else, before the public. That's why we are here. So these used to be called, I mean, if we re, you've heard different things, friends and family of the builder, pre-VIP, sure. platinum broker, different, names. different things. Yeah. You're basically getting it at the first opportunity before it opens to the public, yes. okay? And I don't know about you, but whenever I have those opportunities Absolutely. in life, I'm willing to pay because yeah. it's, it's an opportunity just to get in the door, right? Yeah, yeah. So, so, so the difference could be uh, either they're going to be sold out. Yeah. That 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 could be one of the reasons why yeah, you sure. would not be able to get one. Yeah. Uh, the second one, uh, you will not be able to pick the lot. Yeah. Because when there's like 300 people in this space here, yeah. Yeah. it would be hard. And we all went through that, even yes. as as realtors and, and buying and stuff like that, like. It's a mess. Like people are just running around, everybody putting stickers on different, um, different lots and stuff like that. So, uh, if you're in the space, if you're in the market, either to invest yeah. or to move down this way, give us a call. Yes. It's the best opportunity you will find till April the 29th. For Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. We, you know, when we talk about the, the reputation of the developer, look them up. They have a great record. When you look at the type of product we're getting into, this is what modern families want. They want this style. They want this type of, you know, modern finishings. Mod it's not an older cookie cutter style place. You're getting a very sure. top notch modern home. And, and also too, you're buying into, someone said it earlier, if someone could take a time machine and go back to Milton circa 20 years ago, or go back to like, you know, North Oakville 20 years ago, they thought people were crazy for buying there. hundred percent. Well, now if you ask those very same people, they're probably kicking themselves. They'll be like, I wish I bought three. 
<laughs> so don't let this be your and, opportunity that you missed out And some people on. could have bought three. Right. I remember those times. So, so this might be the opportunity because I think the trend now is moving toward Niagara. Uh, this Absolutely. side, for the next 20 years, a lot of the And even from a Metro standpoint, you know, one of my good clients and colleagues works for Metrolinks. You know, they're creating it so that you can go to the city within an hour and a half without driving. Yes. So if you can work from home, Go train is coming to Niagara Falls exactly. and all that. Exactly. So we, we it's all already in St. Catharines and whatnot. So yeah. And and people are focusing towards towards life more. Yeah. Like don't you don't Absolutely. you think like you know they they want life they want freedom they want to enjoy they want to live somewhere they want nature they want birds they want canals we, they want water. We live in one of the most you know? beautiful countries in the world, known for nature and wildlife. But we grow up in an area where all you see is concrete. Concrete, uh, concrete jungle. Yeah, absolutely. So I, right. I, I, you know, I'm, I'm, I actually feel it fortunate and, and blessed when I meet new clients that move here from other countries that are willing to go where we're not going because I they know. actually get to see a beautiful part of the country. Yes. You know what I mean? So, when is the best time to buy real estate? Right now. The next back time is right now. The yeah. Next time is right now. Yesterday. Yeah. So.